the last thing I need to look for is currency and coverage. If I scroll down, I can see that the Yerba Montana article was written on October 15, 2017. When it comes to coverage, the Yerba Montana page is well laid out and easy to follow. That being said, it's still lacking supporting evidence for its claims. When I go back to the Medline Plus page, I can scroll to the bottom and see that the content was last reviewed on June 4th of 2019, so it should be relatively up to date. The coverage on the Medline Plus page is very thorough and laid out in a clear, concise way. Further, it provides navigation tools so that I can skip directly to the section I'm most interested in. For instance, if I wanted to know about safety concerns, I can just click here and go straight to that section. Both pages are relatively current and easy to read. However, when taking all of the criteria into consideration, the Medline Plus page on Yerba Mate provides the best information for me to make an informed decision.